there. So yesterday we motored most of the way across to Forney and got there far past five. And the wind had dropped off, a bit of a swell, not too bad, but gradually it picked up during the night. And we were due to leave, or we planned to leave early hours, about six o'clock in the morning, but at about what time was it? About three o'clock, three a.m. Um, the wind had got up and we just decided to up the anchor and go. We've now got both sails up and we're doing about five knots, so it's pretty good at the moment. Should be there for about four o'clock this afternoon. Right, yep. ready? So we're in the Alton Eunice Hotel Marina and we've come into Chesme Town to just call in at the supermarket, have a bit of a walk in fresh air, go to the bank. So yeah, just have a nose around and it's this is an absolutely lovely town. A little bit more expensive than some of the other places we've been to, the more local places to us in Dindon. But um, similar to Bodrum prices probably. Boys have been a bit wimpy. They think it's going to be cold. Probably is actually. It is only the 29th of April. So we're off again. We're leaving Chesney. And where are we heading? We're heading to Ivalik. Ivalik, which is yet another marina. It's another set of a marina. So this will take us how long did we reckon? 16, 16 miles. Yep, so we're going to do an overnighter again tonight and um, arrive in the morning. Plenty of time in daylight hours to be able to tie up and chill out. about half past seven in the morning um, we've had a very quiet night. We left at five o'clock tea time yesterday, we left Chesme and we're heading up to Ivaluk Marina which again is on this sort of northwest coast of Turkey. Clues. Can you get to a cardinal? <laughs> and they wave. Yeah. Bloody hell.
just leaving the marina at Iverlook. What did we think of Iverlook? Not that. Yeah, why? It wasn't the nicest place in the world, was it? Yeah, it was a little bit shabby. What was the marina like? It's very, well, it's, it's okay, it's tired. It's full of um, resident Turkish boats. Um, not many foreigners, I don't think. Yeah. Um, facilities were good, showers were amazing. Yeah. Um, there weren't many bars, restaurants, cafes or anything within the site. No. And the town itself was a little bit, I don't know, shabby, I'd say. Yeah. Tired. Time to fill in the log. Every two hours. Yeah, we're done. So we're on a 48 hour sail now. We set off from Ivalik on the western coast of Turkey and our next stop is going to be Istanbul. But we've got to go through a narrow passage called the Dardanelles which takes us past an island or in between an island and the mainland. A little bit daunting because it is quite narrow and it is a shipping channel as well so you've got the chance of big vessels trying to pass by you. So that we're going to make sure we do in daylight which will be first thing tomorrow morning probably about 6-7 o'clock depending on our wind speed. Um, had the sails out a couple of times, but the wind is just trying to evade us. Just keeps coming on the nose and then dropping off again. But we're getting there, we're doing really good speed. We're doing sort of between four and a half and five knots most of the time. Coming through the Dardanelles, we've been coming through for a couple of hours now, and there's just ship after ship after ship, and it's um, yeah, amazing. You just come through the narrowest part, and you get so close to them, they're just enormous. There's a great big MSC on its way towards us, and they are just huge. But the Coast Guard will pass three or four times. I'm not looking at you, I'm looking at the bloody great steel thing coming up behind us. Boiling of tea tonight? Mm. Pasta bolognese. Pasta bolognese. No. Last night then? What happened last night? Last night, um, 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 well, we were in Istanbul. 
we're in mid 40 hour journey towards Istanbul from Ivalik. So we had a night going through the Dardanelles, which was quite interesting, quite a lot of ships. Um, calmed down by sort of just after midnight, fewer and fewer ships, which is good. Um, seems a little bit lively, but yeah, other than that, nothing too exciting. The wind wasn't enough to put the sail out, always on the nose, which is a bit of a pain. But other than that, it was quite a quiet night. And we're just about, I don't know, an hour and a half maybe from Istanbul. So we're just sort of getting into the right position to end up in the marina. Oh, it's chock-a-block busy, isn't it?